50 million years ago, during the dawn of modern mammals, a pig-like animal appeared. It probably spent most of its life in the water. But its descendants would become the largest mammals ever to live on dry land. The elephants. At one time, 11 species of elephant roamed the world, but almost all have since become extinct. last to suffer this fate was the awesome woolly mammoth about 10,000 years ago. Today, only three species of elephants remain in Africa and Asia. They haven't completely lost their prehistoric ties. Two of the elephant's closest living relatives, manatees and dugongs, still spend their lives in the water. Hi, I'm Jason Bell, and I'm the Regional Director for the International Fund for Animal Welfare in Southern Africa, and I also head up IFOR's Elephant Program. One of the biggest threats confronting elephant populations in the wild is the demand for ivory, notably in the east. Last year was the worst year on record for large-scale ivory seizures. Um, it was also the worst year on record so far since uh, accurate data has been kept for elephant poaching. It is estimated that between 25,000 and 40,000 elephants were poached for their ivory last year. There's a serious problem in Central Africa. Uh, there are problems in East Africa. The poaching wave is headed down south. Um, and if we don't act soon, uh, we could lose uh, many of Africa's elephants. IPO is working um, at every link in the trade chain. Uh, we're working with governments on the ground to enhance capacity for anti-poaching. Uh, we're working with uh, governments in transit countries to try and prevent illegal trade. And we're working in the world's main consumer market, China, to try and change people's attitudes um, and to show them that an elephant in the wild uh, is far more valuable than an ivory carving on a shelf. Uh, the International Fund for Animal Welfare uh, urges the global community to join forces to take action in dealing with poaching and illicit trade. At the end of the day, we cannot afford to go down this road. We saw what happened in the 1980s when Africa's elephant population was halved in a 10-year period to furnish the demand for ivory, notably in the East. We cannot allow that to happen again. Okay. Mm -hmm. 